Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a review of the Downton Abbey movie that I watched today with my friend and I could not praise the film enough. It was brilliant, the acting was really really good, the storyline was really good, it kept us gripped from start to finish but I must say uh, during the last 10 minutes of the film there is a dancing scene with a lot of spinning around and people getting up and down which really aggravated my sensory issues and actually made me feel really quite unwell after the film. I actually had to come home quite straight away because I felt really dizzy and sick and lightheaded and I've not had that reaction before to a film so I don't know if it's just a part of my autism playing up or the fact that I was having issues with coping with the film but it was a very very good film I liked the storyline I liked the fact that all the cast were back together for one final time of getting back together and seeing everyone act and it was a brilliant film I loved all the dresses the costumes everyone looked mega smart as per usual as they do for Downton Abbey it was a really really great film again I loved the characters the storyline the costumes were absolutely amazing the music's beautiful and yeah, unfortunately I had a sensory issue reaction to it the last 10 minutes or so of the film really just aggravated me. I don't know why, but it made all my head go all spinny and made all my chest hurt. So I don't know if it's just an autism reaction or if I was just reacting to this sensory stimuli that I was having at the time. But it's a really, really good film. If you do like Doubt and Abbey, if you are a, feel, a fan of Doubt and Abbey, I do encourage you to go and watch it. It's a really, really great film, well acted, great music, great scenes, a really good feel, good family film. If you are fans of the show, which I am a big fan of the show, I have actually got the DVDs in my DVD collection. And I once again, it was a great film. I really do advertise it strongly for you to go and see it. But if you're strongly opposed to flashing lights or if you don't like high-pitched sound music, then it might not be for you. Uh, just to pre-warn you, there's a lot of high-pitched music and some quite strong lighting scenes in the film. But apart from that, if you like the music and you like hearing traditional stories and seeing people in traditional dress, dresses and headbands and dancing to music and having feasts, then I should strongly suggest you go and watch the film. It was a really fantastic film. Again, I loved it apart from the last 10 minutes. It really caused my autism to kick off and caused me to feel really quite unwell but apart from that i'm going to say it's a great film and just be warned that if you are autistic or have any issues with lights or sensory issues that it may cause you to trigger and just to make sure you have someone with you and just to make sure that you're okay but i i sadly reacted to the, to the last 10 minutes of the film but you may not react to it i know everyone on the autistic spectrum is different and thanks for watching bye guys